Hello my great people, this is Priscilla Nyeria from Wonderful Heaven Fruits Orchard and today I'm in Kajiado County to deliver and also to present to my farmer different fruits. The farmer requested me to have her own orchard like the Wonderful Heaven. So I have delivered different fruits, apples, dragon fruit, peaches, persimmon, sour soap, pixie and uh, of course Wambogo apple. And this is our farmer today. Hi, mom. Hi. How are you? I'm great, and you? I'm fine, thank you. Yes. Welcome to Wonderful Heaven Fruits Orchard. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Where are we? We are in uh, Kachato County, mm -hmm. near Oloika International School. Oloika International School. Yeah. Yeah, just mm -hmm. some few kilometers yeah. mm -hmm. from Oloika International School. Yeah. So. We will go to the farm, get to see how you have prepared it and what inspired you to do different fruits and not one. Ah, uh, uh, when I watched your first interview with Lin Ngugi, mm -hmm. I was so impressed. Wow. You said you did not even want an agronomist. Yes, yes. So I thought it was something easy. <laughs> so I want to do it. Okay. Yeah. But you have to love it. I it's, have loved it's it. It's not hard and it's not easy. <laughs> I have loved it because I've been watching your videos. Mm -hmm. I, I even plant when I'm just watching. So, oh, okay. so you have plant. I have learned something. Now yeah. we are ready to go and plant. I can see you have your... Uh, yeah, I have my... Your special. instruments. Yes. So this is yeah. the apple. Mm -hmm. And this step, we, we were saying it could have been removed to cancer. All right. Okay, because of the condition that it is right now, yeah. if we removed before delivering, yeah. we would have a lot of breakage okay. on uh, the way. Okay. But now, immediately after planting, mm. we can remove it. Okay. Yes. Okay. That's why we didn't remove. Okay. Yeah. But it's yeah. ready to be removed. You are the, the teacher. Yeah, I'm the teacher. Mm. <laughs> then you remove this one. You have forgotten one step. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> what did I forget? You Yeah, on a rare upper chin. Up here at the bottom. Up on the opacity. Mm -hmm. I didn't know this. Ulilala kwa class. I know. <laughs> Now it can. Oh, yeah. Oh, it a kitten. What I forgot. Yeah. You squeeze it eh? so that when you are removing this paper, it does not leave one another. Yes. Yeah. My brother. Uh -huh. when, when they are removing, when you are removing this, before you remove, before you remove, you squeeze it to be together like yeah, this. Like this. You, then we now put it in the the holes. In the holes. This one first. Yeah. No, up, no up but the hole. Hmm? The hole is too deep, so okay. if you plant it there, you find that sometimes you can even come up to this Oh, okay, point. yeah. So we will first take back some soil. Oh, okay. I think it's enough. Well, continue. Yeah. Add more, add more. If it's enough, now we can plant. You can do no, even putting it there because we will take back some more soil. Okay. 
Yes, but to at the middle of the, the hole. In the middle of the hole. Is that in the middle? <laughs> it should be straight. Yours is slanting. Can you do it better? <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. Yeah. Now add more soil. Have you applied any, any pesticide? No, we have not applied any. You apply if need be. That is if your leaves like are the being weather, attacked. The way the weather is. You should apply the fungicide. Yes, that's yes. what I'm asking. Yes, the fungicide because of the weather. So we... Now you can use this grass as mulching. To cover it. Yeah. Okay. Good. Now we can go to plant the other plants. Which one do you want us to start with? Let's do with the peaches. Where? Where? This way. This side. This what is I, the peach. What, what I, uh, I've forgotten. Mm -hmm. What was the spacing for the peaches? Peaches. Hmm. Five by five meters. Five by five meters. Huh. Yes. We did not do that. You do. So, yes, do three by one. Three. Yeah, three. Three by three? No, three, three by, by two, and two and a half. So you will skip one of the holes. You can use the three, but yeah. now the two and a half, huh. you skip one, so it will be five. No, what if we do it in one line? And then you skip the other one, the middle one. If we skip that, it will be too, the space will be too big, yeah? No, hmm. it will be okay because it will be five meters. Oh, okay, yes. okay. Oh, so yeah, we yeah, take the yeah. peach and the... We didn't take a persimmon here. Peach and yeah. the persimmon. Yeah, those ones, I want them to be in one line. In one line? Yeah. Okay. Mm. How, how long does it take to... One year to start fruiting. But it will <laughs> be a very big plant. That's why you are giving a large spacing, spacing. of five meters by five meters. Okay. Yeah. And for this one, mm. make sure that while watering, mm. you are able to measure your water correctly. If you ah. give excess, mm -hmm. it will dry. It will dry. Yes, it will dry faster compared to the apples. apples. If so, you, you are not able to water it well, it is mm. able to be affected more faster compared to the apples. Uh, so what's and the duration of dripping? Dripping, you, are, you know your drip depends on the pressure of your source. So for this one, we can say you'll be giving it twice a week, but now, whenever you are watering it, make sure that it is well watered, like it's flooded for the two days. For the two days? Yes. It's, you find that some drips after two hours, it has watered that place. Others, five hours. So it depends on the pressure of your water. Another thing I, I can ask, because mm -hmm. I want to do the, these different fruits mm -hmm. for the same line. Yeah. Do they behave the same? Okay. For the peaches and nectarine mm -hmm. and apricot, mm. you can put them together because they are the same class. Family, yeah. But now, like persimmon, mm. you can put it near the apple. Even the spacing is the same with the apples. Oh. Yeah. Okay. So for the peaches, nectarine, and uh, apricot, uh -huh. put them somewhere in the same area. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Because care and everything is the same. Is the same. Okay. Yeah. In this place, it is, in the morning it is very cold, mm -hmm. and uh, in the with the, with the lot of mist. Yeah. Before before six. Yeah. And in the evening, it is also very cold and very windy. Mm -hmm. So what will affect the fruits? And again, during the day, it's... Ah, the, yeah, during the day also, it's very hot. It's very and hot. And sometimes, mm -hmm. it is also very hot the whole day. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. No, in that case, when it is 
having we have mist and uh, the coldness kibaridi in yeah, the yeah, morning yeah, yeah. that's why we were saying you are required to spray the fungicides fungicide yeah mm -hmm. in the in other words is dawa ya baridi okay. to prevent it from the attack to your plants all of them oh what will show you that that this plant is affected like now i can mm -hmm. see some spots here could uh -huh. it be no mm -hmm. that one is not the case mm -hmm. it is starts behaving like it's folding the leaves okay it's like it's feeling the oh. cold oh, the way you oh yeah oh yeah fold okay. yourself yes so that is how the leaves will start behaving oh okay yeah for okay. these ones yeah. and uh, that is, this is the persimmon yeah. and for the apples as well okay even this this one mostly is not affected by the cold or mm. the mist bring the peach mm. mm -hmm. the peach mm -hmm. but what will happen you see now the peach it has been shocked faster compared to the apple oh okay uh -huh. the shock oh this is the transplant shock you see they are, they are starting to wither yeah. at the top yeah so if they wither at the top after planting yeah. you remove the leaves you know, oh after you plant even uh -huh. the apples uh -huh. if they start behaving like this uh -huh. you remove these leaves the top leaves oh okay yeah. Oh, okay. Th that those are some of the transplant shock. So for this yeah. that area that are, is receiving mist and uh -huh. frost, uh -huh. you spray the fungicides. Oh, okay. To prevent it from being okay. affected. Oh, okay. Yeah, and also duration. Huh? Oh, oh. How long do you take? after you have sprayed it the first time you can spray like after every 14 days mm -hmm. you spray twice twice yes because even if it is windy and uh, we have the mist and yeah. all that yeah. it doesn't go throughout the year oh. sometimes you find that there is no that wind and so, again because mm -hmm. you you sprayed before the the plant was affected yeah. it's like you are preventing you are not curing oh yeah so that means mm -hmm. You don't just wake up and just spray because you have seen wind. <laughs> wind or you have seen If you mist. feel the, the mist, yeah. you can spray. Yeah. yeah to oh. prevent. Oh. Okay. Before they start to, to fold to, the to. leaves and to to okay. shed. Okay. You know it starts by folding and then it turns brown and it sheds. Oh okay. Before it gets to you you to be required to do a curative one, uh -huh. you can do a pre preventive, preventive one. one. Yes. Oh okay. And where do we get this? Uh... Yeah, the, we are using a fungicide, pesticide. Mm -hmm. You use it when you see a pest mm -hmm. or any and, insect. But yeah. now in this case, we are talking about, about the, the fungicide. fungicide. And are there specific soaps yeah. that we can? Yes, mm -hmm. there are specific brand. Mm -hmm. Those ones I will, I will share to you mm -hmm. that we use to these plants. I will have to share. Yeah, to prevent. To prevent. Yeah. Yeah. The, the one to prevent is mm. different from the one to cure. Oh, okay. And it's easier to prevent than sure. to cure. And what impressed me is mm. that you will be helping the farmers. Mm -hmm. Are you promising that <laughs> you will be there for us? <laughs> yes, actually, even Kitengela, I'm having different Do farms. Mm -hmm. Actually, even next week on Friday, yeah. I'm ca on Wednesday. Uh, where are you coming? I'm so coming to Kitengela prison. Oh, prison? Yeah, that's yeah, prison it, it, area. Yeah, uh -huh. yeah, I have a school that we are planting there. Oh, okay. Yes. We will be disturbing you? No, no, it's not disturbing. disturbing. It's following up. We, uh, we will, you, Don't we, get tired of asking me, is this one okay? How can we solve this? Yeah. Always inquire. And because he's the one who will be here most mm -hmm. of the time, mm -hmm. I will give you him the, uh, your number uh -huh. so that he can be contacting you okay mm. even that wednesday mm -hmm. i think i'll just speak him yes, yes. then we come and learn together something. yeah yeah mm. this one is the same one this one you know this is persimmon but you plant <laughs> this is the one i told you can plant near the apples near i the think apples. i will write to you these yeah. things the uh -huh. one that you can plant near the apples to each other okay yes. okay okay Okay, what else do we put here now? Where? We it's the, the same, right? We it, plant the same. Yeah, right. it's the same. Mm. Now, because you are planting different, mm. this one we can plant it this side because this side? you can also plant together with the apples. Okay, yeah. okay, okay. The same way we have planted mm. applies to all the plants, except okay. the dragon fruit. Yeah. I am not seeing the poles. 
No, we did, we did not. <laughs> I'm looking for the poles. We don't have them, mm -hmm. but... But you know how to plant. Yeah. You Actually, yeah, is, you are a good student. I know how to plant, mm -hmm. but if I'm defeated, I will take a yes. video when I'm planting. And then I can correct. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> sour on the way. I know. <laughs> <laughs> sour. Mm -hmm. Now I can see you have a lot of pipes. You have tanks there. Mm -hmm. You have the solar. Where are you sourcing your water from? My water is from the... We, we, we dug a pothole. Mm -hmm. We used to have a lot of problems with the, with the water. Mm -hmm. So, and this place is very dry. So getting water by tanks, it was very expensive. So we decided to do the pothole. Uh, it costed a lot initially, mm -hmm. but now, we don't pay anything. Yeah. We use the energy, the the, the, the solar, the solar, mm -hmm. and we don't pay any bill now. Mm -hmm. And the water is just enough for us. It's enough for you. The the pole is uh, about 250 meters down. Mm -hmm. So when we pump, mm -hmm. it takes about one hour or two hours. When the sun sign is good, mm -hmm. it takes about two hours mm -hmm. to fill the. 40 cubic. Wow, two mm -hmm. hours to fill the 40 cubic. Mm -hmm. So it's mm -hmm. giving like 20 cubic yeah. meters per hour. Per hour. And that is more than enough yeah. for a farmer. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I chose the fruits mm -hmm. because as I was listening, mm -hmm. you only water maybe twice a week. Yes. Or, yeah. So it is it is it still is okay. Easier. Yeah. It's enough. 20 yeah. cubic meters mm. it's it's enough for that work. Yeah. 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 And so, we have about four tanks so, mm -hmm. so you have good story yeah okay. when the sunshine is good we we still keep the okay the the water mm -hmm. it costed um, it actually it took about 4m mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. all together but it's a one time cost yeah it's a one time cost uh -huh. initially it was hard yeah but when it's we finish easy we are okay. Yeah, I'm yeah. even shocked to hear that you're going to 250 meters. In Laikipia, mm -hmm. you go to about from 130 to 200. Oh, this one was up to 250. Okay, we have several boreholes, mm -hmm. but my, my deepest one is 187 mm -hmm. meters. Mm -hmm. This one is 250. 250, yeah. Wow. We are lucky then. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, even we have one that is 117 and it produces the most. It gives 50 cubic meters per hour. Okay. But now, the cost of installing the solar, that is where it gets high if your borehole is giving more water. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, mm. that is how it works. Okay, let me give you a simple calculation, mm. like the one I'm using. It ranges about three to four million. Yeah. You will go, most of the these drilling companies, yeah. they cost about 6,500, that is 6,500 to 7,000 per meter. And that is drilling only. Only, yeah. Actually, first of all, we did the drilling yes. and it stayed for <laughs> one year. Yeah. We are just looking at it like that. And the water is not coming out. So yeah. it's just a hole that has yeah. water. Yeah. So the 6,500 is only drilling the hole. Yeah. So if it is going to 200, so you do your, the mathematics. your mathematics there. Mm. Then you have the cost of the pump. You also yeah. put the cost of Sanvata, the one that will convert the solar yeah. energy to electricity. Yeah, we, we have it. Yeah. yeah. And then the cost, those are different costs. Like yeah. the Sanvata, you find that is about 100,000. And then ah. the the pump also around there, and also the solar costs. It will depend on which company you choose. Yeah. They are different company. You find that one panel, it might be around seventeen thousand, twenty thousand, depending on even the watts. Then after that, you are not done. There is the cost of constructing the tower the, the tower, water tower yeah the tower and buying the tanks now yeah. the storage yeah. part yeah so that's why it's adding up to about four million it, it might actually more. it goes more yeah i did not say the cost of the tower the and the tanks yes yeah that's quite different it, it the tower more. took about actually more than six hundred thousand. yes yeah 
And then and the tanks were seventy thousand each. Mm -hmm. yeah. Now it's eighty five. Now yes. okay. <laughs> now yeah. it's eighty five. So you mm -hmm. can do your calculations. Yes. But now the cost of solar and all the other cost, it will depend on the quantity your borehole is giving. If it's giving less water, the cost of installing the solar and all that will be lower. If yeah. it's giving more, the more the cost because you need more powerful equipment, equipment. and uh, even more solars. Actually, I say if somebody wants to do the the hole and everything, mm -hmm. Budget at 5 M. Yes. Yeah, it will be fine. And still, you are not done with, with the irrigation. No, we have not come here. <laughs> the yeah, farm. we are talking about the source of water. Yes. Yeah. You have your water with 5 M and uh, the storage. Yeah. Then you add the cost of drip. Like yeah. an acre, I have mm. seen people asking me how much it costs. Like an acre, depending on the pipes you are using. Yeah. This one. Um, so you find that some places it will cost about two hundred thousand an yeah, acre. An acre. Yes. Yeah, right there. And even the labor, everything. I mean. Yeah, yeah. Two hundred thousand. Yeah. I want to take this opportunity to thank you. We have waited, but at least you came. Yeah. We are happy, and uh, I want to tell you thank you for what you are doing. Most I admire welcome. it. Mm -hmm. And I want to be like you. Welcome, welcome. <laughs> I, want to I remember like you. we were talking, mm. we were having this discussion when you were outside the country. Yeah, I was outside the country. Uh -huh. This one is what brought me, this project brought me. Uh -huh. So you uh, work there? No, I don't work. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I stay with my children. Oh, yeah. okay. Yeah. You stay but with when these children. fruits will be good enough to give me resources, mm -hmm. I come back. You, you should. Come I have back. created a job here. Yes. And home is good. Yes. This yeah. or West home is the best. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. yeah. Good. We don't need to go outside. No, 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 no. Yeah. We build our own Kenya, yeah. our own Africa. Yeah. It's beautiful. Yes, it yeah. is. Mm. Good. Yeah. Thank you so much. You've seen. Yes. How happy we are when you came. And how beautiful this place is. Yeah. <laughs> it's like another like Kipia here. Yeah. Yes. Mm. It's another like Kipia in Kajedo County. Oh, what we forgot to, to, to say. And even we forgot to mention your name. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> we were so excited yes. until we thought. You know, I've talked to you several times. Yes. I am at home, so. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so there is no My name is. Here. Josephine Ondari, mm -hmm. I come from Kisi, mm -hmm. but I'm a Kitengera yes. resident. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Good. Yes. And this is your farm it's, team? Yeah, this is my farm team. Yes. It's, it's the one who manages the, the farm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they help one another there. Okay. Yeah. Good. Mm -hmm. So we are working with these people, actually. Yes, yeah, 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 yeah. This is my and, team. This is my team, mm -hmm. but there are some who are not here yes, yet. They are offloading. Yeah, they are offloading. Yeah. Good. Mm -hmm. Nice. So mm -hmm. now, mm -hmm. thank you very much for even starting this journey. You know, you can be saying, oh, I want to do it, I want to do it. But you, you started, yeah. you even started Lipa Pole Pole. I, uh, yeah, <laughs> that's what I said. And I've, that's what I've been doing. Yes, <laughs> she has been paying in uh, bits, bits, Lipa Pole in a, Pole. In advance, yeah. <laughs> so by the time she's coming back mm. to our land in mm. Kenya, she has already paid for all the plants. So you I can... want you to help me so that you will be visiting this farm mm -hmm. almost all the every time. month, every month, yeah. after every three months. Yeah. And if I happen to be around Kitengela even before the three months, yeah. I will come. Please. Yes. We appreciate. Good. Yeah. So thank you very much to my diaspora farmers and even to my Will I call you local farmers? <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> to my Kenyan farmers. Yeah, that's beautiful. Yeah, mm. saying local, it looks a bit... Yeah, it looks a little bit rude. No, yeah. you are not local. Yeah. We are yeah. all international farmers because we are farming not to do it locally, yeah. but also to export. Thank you. Good. Yeah. So thank you very much for your support, your questions. Don't feel tired of asking questions, so always 
ask a question and the easiest way to reach me is not through the comment section it's through a text message you can whatsapp me or call me actually whatsapp is the easiest because i can get the message anytime call sometimes you might find it's busy but for those who know i always call back so thank you very much for your um, time watching this video let me know what didn't you understand so that we can talk about it in the next video my kitengela before i'm coming back next week so be prepared if you need anything i can bring you from like keep here this is your african fruit farming queen from the only heaven on earth wonderful heaven fruit orchard see you in my next video maybe in your county or country bye bye